Hey guys, quick video here only uh, to show you the gear that you have to prepare yourself to bring to Northern Norway if you're camping around here. We are now in Narvik, you can see the mountains here. And uh, we saw loads of Northern Lights last night. It was very beautiful. Now, I'm gonna show you the gear very quickly and then uh, you can buy your own gear, you can make your own assumptions what you have to bring or not. Just uh, the sites there that tell sometimes of to what gear to bring and what to do, they it's normally very expensive the gear they, they advise and uh, I, did a, I did a bit of research and this gear is doing the job for me. So let's go first to the tent. The tent is a Vango Idra tent. It was, uh, I bought it from uh, online, I bought it online for 35 euro and uh, it is from 1996. It's old, it's a fourth season but it's doing the job. It's kind of heavy but it's doing the job okay. Okay, so the sleeping bag we are using there is a snug pack sleeping extreme. It was 33 pounds online, uh, 44 pounds at 44 euro with delivery. So it's a it's a very 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 good price, and the rating is up to minus seven comfort and minus ten limits. It's fantastic. Does a job for Northern Norway. So you can see the mat there. It was uh, it, it is a green uh, a gray mat. It's a closed cell mat. We paid uh, ten pounds on it. It's very good. Very nice. Very good price, and then there is the cooking kit. Is uh, this kit will allow you to burn uh, alcohol, burn mats on that. So it's very good. I'm burning now. I'm, I'm cooking out some snow to to melt and make some rice now. So uh, I paid on this kit here, 18 euro, a very cheap. However, you can bring as well the this cooking device here. This, uh, this this kind of stove like don't bring the comfy gas bring the MSR or the kind that it's not camping gas because you won't f it's very hard to find this connector here in Norway okay so just be careful with that we found a shop uh, to, to, to sell these bottles here but it's not common to find gas for this guy here so and then the last thing uh, to tell you is the footprint get a good footprint this footprint here we get we got for free uh, from a friend. It is used in the constructions uh, to insulate houses. So it it's very good in insulation. You can see that there's no like uh, of course the, the the snow would not stick, but the water you you control water on it and it won't stick on it. So anyway, uh, this is my video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like it. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to check my website is uh, borealis-aurora.com. Uh, Thank you, bye-bye.